now I have with me Karan Brar. Welcome to Showbiz India. How are you feeling here tonight? Uh, I'm so excited and I'm so happy that I get to meet some of my Indian idols. It's it's a really big thing for me and it's so great to see other Indian actors making it, uh, making it here in Hollywood and I think it's a big part of India. And Reliance, you know, Mr. Anil Ambani, who put together this whole thing, is honoring everyone who has contributed from the South Asian descent to Hollywood. That must be an amazing feeling that at such a young age, you're a part of this ensemble. Yes, that's, uh, it's definitely really important, uh, important to me because I just feel like in America, Hollywood is all made up of different ethnicities and now India is sort of stepping its foot into, uh, into Hollywood, which is a big deal and I think that we can, uh, we can show our culture to other people and we can represent it and I think that's so amazing. Yes, and you speak very well. How old are you? Uh, I'm 14 now. <laughs> <laughs> and how did you decide that acting was a calling for you? Well, uh, when I was seven, I really I, I sucked at sports, and everyone else was great at it. So my dad's like, "Hey, I did uh, theater in college. Did you want to try acting?" I was like, "Okay, sure, I'll try it." And this is the first time I ever heard my dad did theater, and he was like, "Why not try?" I was like, "Okay, okay, I'll try it." So I did acting. I got a few commercials, and then I got uh, I got an audition for a movie called Diary of the Wimpy Kid. So I did that, and I I got the role, which was so exciting. And uh, 20th Century Fox was so amazing to me. They were so great, and. And uh, that was my big break. And after that, I kept working. And then I landed a Disney show called Jesse, which right now we're almost finished with the second season. Stop! Good God, man! You almost got the cheese touch. The what? The cheese touch. One day, a kid named Darren Walsh made the biggest mistake of his life. Cheese. They didn't have the cheese touch. It was worse than nuclear cooties. <laughs> and so began the cheese touch frenzy. It was madness. Until a German exchange student named Dieter Müller took it away. And so the cheese sits, patiently waiting for its next victim. Wow. wow. And you said you're going to be at home watching the Oscars rooting for Life of Pi. Yeah, definitely. Life of Pi is one of my favorite movies this year. I, I definitely love it and I think it's such a great film. It's I just love everything about it, from the script to the actors to the screenplay. And what about, you said you have some of your idols from India. Who are some of your inspirations that you've looked up to? Uh, I've definitely looked up to a lot of actors and to tell you the truth, Everyone here is is like one of my idols because I've seen them since I was a little kid. I remember I used to watch Bend It, for, uh, Bend it Like Beckham with my sister all the time. I used to watch it like every single day and I loved it. And I and I finally get to got to meet the director today, direct, director today which was so exciting.